Good day, this is Prophetess Tevile coming to you from 7750 Media. Let me get on with today's teachings. Today is Youth Day. It is the 17th of June, 2024. Otherwise, it is the 11th of seven on the Hebrew calendar. And uh, seven is the is the third month. Yesterday, a an ex school mate of mine posted a picture of herself standing outside number ten Downing Street in London, England, and number ten Downing Street is a code the Lord has used before when he was engaging me about the downfall of Prince Andrew, the Duke of York, whose downfall and unraveling began with a certain courtier of Buckingham Palace engaging in certain conversations about his conduct at number 10 Downing Street the Prime Minister's residence. Before I retired to bed last night, the Lord gave me a sentence and he said, I must write it down. So I did. I recorded here. And the Lord said to me, a man whose business empire is built on illicit sexual affairs with the wives of other men. And then I was given the name of Ryan Miller, which I will break down and explain a bit later on. I'm just laying the foundation, as it were, for where the Lord is going. And then the Lord said to me, your gift will make room for you and bring you before great people. That is a scripture from Proverbs chapter 18, verse 16. And the second thing he told me was that in the city of Ephesus, so mightily grew the word of God and prevailed. And that is Acts chapter 19, verse 20. And this is one of the signature script, uh, scriptures that were used by Pastor Chris Oyakilome of Christ Embassy in his videos and teachings. The next thing the Lord gave me was a network of information and energy that transcends time and space. Obviously, I already have experienced this because I am a dreamer of dreams. And the dreams that I dream manifest. I never know when they're gonna manifest, but certainly they do manifest. And so this vision and the sentence that the Lord gave me now to lay the foundation for something that is imminent about to happen it did not begin now. The Lord God has been working on it for several years. And then the fourth thing that he gave me was the narcissistic collapse and the collapse of a narcissist. God speaks and he will confirm his word by repetition, especially when something is imminent. Rebecca Zong discusses the collapse of a narcissist on her YouTube channel. And the one thing she talks about is how the narcissist personality spends their lifetime trying to cover up things, trying to put on this show and trying to masquerade so that people don't see what is really going on underneath the shell. She makes the point that narcissistic people are constantly trying to grab everything they possibly can to make themselves feel better and to make themselves look better. Rebecca Zong, like myself, is an attorney by profession and she calls herself your go-to guru for mastering the art of negotiation and high conflict communication. 
She teaches people how to slay the narcissist bully who is trying to bring them down. Literally, when the Lord tells me that I'm every woman, it is precisely because in my life, I live in the scripts of a multitude of women. Some already dead, but many more are still alive. In the interest of time, I'm going to stop this broadcast here for now. And then I'll come back and start breaking down those nuggets that the Lord gave me. Thanks for listening.